and now the Executive Vice President of the Home Builders Association of Louisville. I've heard from many people recently that have an interest in buying a new home that they're very nervous and very cautious about selling their existing home. Slow market, they've heard that people can't sell, and that's really not true these days. But there are some very tried and true tips that many people really need to hear when they're, ex when they're ready to sell their existing home to buy that new home. Now today I've got with me Teresa Morgan from ERA Keppel Keen Realtors. And Teresa, you're going to provide our viewers with a few tips on selling their existing home, something that works in this slower market. Right, and I think that's real important to be prepared in advance. And probably the first thing, Chuck, is the outside of the home. You need to make sure that it's meticulous. You need to paint that front door, trim those shrubs, uh, you know, edge the yard. Just do all those things because that's the first impression. And they say a person makes up their mind in the first 60 seconds. Right, when so, they drive up to right that house. Right, when they drive up. So yep. that's really, really important. A second thing is a pre-home inspection. And a lot of people haven't done that in the past, but now when you get a buyer that wants to buy your home, you don't want to lose that buyer after they've written a contract because they get scared over some mechanical things. So I've been recommending that people will go ahead, have that pre-home inspection, and then that way they can look over the things that the inspector has found to be a problem and take care of those no ahead of time. No surprises. No surprises. That's, that's a, that's and you just want to make sure if you've got a contract, you don't want to lose it you know, midstream like that. So All I right. think that's real, real important. A third thing is fresh paint just does wonders. It's probably one of the least expensive things you can do for a home that will give it, it just really brightens it, it, it makes it look new, and like I said, it just really adds. So I think that's probably really, really important. They get it on that inside like the outside, drive correct, up the curb field. Correct, real. yes, and, and all the way through because that is the one thing and that you can do that just really makes it feel feel new, feel fresh, so I think that's important. And the next thing is a stager. I think a stager designer is absolutely so important now. You know, they can go in your home and they can look at it and they can tell you to just rearrange things or just, and especially when you're going to paint, make sure you ask that designer or Having stager. Having a professional to give you some suggestions Correct. on what to do. And a lot, I mean, they're really inexpensive. They, I've got a designer that works for me that she also designs several of the homes in Home Rama. She only charges $75 an hour, and I mean, that is probably the best Maybe money Maybe even one hour can. works out for some. Oh, like absolutely. That. One hour can do lots. And then declutter, and she'll go into that. But, you know, it's so hard to, to sell a home when you've got too much furniture. Right. You have to, you live in a home totally different than the way you sell it. We all kind of get used to stuff that are in our house. And it's kind of like it need, if it's worked around, I mean, that first impression walking in the door is real important. That's what Absolutely. And you can have very expensive furniture, big furniture, but that's going to make your home appear so much smaller. So what you want to do, you know, is truly rent that storage and take half of the things that are in your home and put it that's in storage. That's great suggestion. Uh, I mean, because, and that's what it's hard for people to understand, but keep in mind, like I said, you live in a house totally different when you sell it. Yes. And, and so when you get rid of those things and put it, you know, in the storage, you're just making it feel twice as large as it is. Why do you think new construction sells, yeah, you right. know, quicker than... That's a good suggestion, them. you bet. Well, those are outstanding. I mean, the tips. And I, I, for our viewers, it is very important. These are things that work in this slow market. I mean, Teresa sells homes. She has, has a very good track record at that. I thought it was a good thing to bring her here. What I'm hoping is, Teresa, I can get you to come back and maybe provide a few more tips in one of our future segments. I'd be happy to. I'd love to have you back. So let, take a look at these tips. Listen for the future tips. You can sell your house in this market. You can buy your new home. Go to hbl.com and check for search for new homes. This is Chuck Cavanaugh heading home.